The Western Irrigation District, or the WID, occupies 3,780 square kilometers on the north side of the Bow River. The district's water is diverted from the Bow River inside the city of Calgary at Calgary's Weir. Headquartered in Strathmore, its land area begins immediately east of the city at Chestermere Lake. Owned by the WID, but managed as a recreation facility, Chestermere Lake can be called upon for emergency water in times of drought. What sets it apart from the other irrigation districts on the Bow River is its proximity to Calgary and the nuances with which its system must share the landscape. It is instrumental in aiding the city with the control of stormwater. The district produces food for the urban population. The city influence provides markets for vegetables, trees, shrubs, and lawn grass. It gets more rainfall per year than the other Bow districts. Of the 96,000 acres the district can serve with irrigation water, as much as half the land might be left unirrigated in a good rain year. Through its hundreds of kilometers of canals and pipelines, the district supplies water to over 400 farms and many communities and households. Urban sprawl provides for rural living. While still in close proximity to Calgary jobs, you will find subdivisions close to canals and water bodies as they fan out eastwards from the city limits. In the WID, the crops produced by irrigation are a familiar mix of cereals, oil seeds, and forages for feed. The WID provides water to several large beef feedlots within its boundaries, as irrigation helps grow grass for grazing, and of course, hay and grain for the feedlots. That makes cattle an irrigation crop too. When water is removed from the bow, some of that water creates wetlands that attract waterfowl. More life aided by irrigation. Some in the cities and towns see irrigation and the WID as a competitor for land and water. Wiser heads will understand that areas of high population need intense local food production. This becomes more true as population grows. Only irrigation can provide the volume and variety of foods the good life demands. As those demands grow, so does the importance of the Western Irrigation District.